Well, it seems like some time passed and hype for nano banana does not die, <laughs> dying so it still be there in this video we look closer why it's so special what is make it different from like a flux or a queen or any other things why it is still be there up front i will tell you i heard some people say it's a dead or photoshop no nope, it's not a dead but it is incredible tool for those who work before with Comfy UI, already kind of familiar with this type approach with the uh, flux context when it's come out or next queen. It's when you have an image and you don't use it any masking or you don't use control net. You're just using text prompt to describe what you want it. And because it's a little bit larger model of the text, it can work very well and keep it consistency. It's got two different approaches between Flux and Quain. I would recommend for you to watch my video where I explain what is different between them. Um, by the way, it will help you also to understand how the Nano Banana work as well. But general, it's a word that will create it. However, they missing one important things that Nano Banana have. And this is the Vikings. No, I'm just kidding. No, they're not missing Vikings. You can create it. But let me show you actually what they're missing in the Flux and uh, the Queen. So right here, image, I just draw of the Viking. Well, with some shapes inside the Photoshop. Yeah, it doesn't look like this. But I was drawing and I says, okay, let's put it this inside the nano banana. And I want to create photorealistic based on this. So this is what created for me nano banana. It is based on style. Well, it's not a surprise. We can done this before, similar with control net inside the comp UI with other models. However, next what I want to do, right example here, I look and weather does not look that horrible. I says, how about you add grass, maybe like tall grass here and add rain. And that's actually what I was asking. I ask right here, make uh, it more bad weathery, rain, high wind, tall patches of grass. And this is actually created. It's exactly the same person, does not change anything, but apply those elements. Well, at this time, Flux can do kind of like this if you're uploading image. And in fact, actually, Flux, you can. You can right here have a preview image and you can click and preload it this again, load it this like refresh, load this image and go over and over again. However, not in a way like Gemini can do here. And by the way, the Nano Banana, it is a kind of like beta version, but it's stuck there because it's kind of fun, actually. It sounds real cool. And but it is work with the Gemini latest image generation. And because of this, it's have this consistency. It's have this session and can reference those images in a session. You can easily just type and says, hey, you remember two images before we add this, this element, bring it back or do these things. Well, I'll show you how it will remember, but that is make us different because in a comfy UI we cannot do for several reasons. One, of course, it's a large language model. Right here, they're utilizing Chimani, which is big. You cannot run that model on your computer. It's just not enough. You need to have it like data centered, uh, big servers to run those models. We just don't have this capacity to do it at home. And beside that large model, the data consistency, and they have their own algorithm as well, which is remind me actually how the Queen algorithm more war. Okay, and right here, for example, same as is add the ships right here. See, it's just add ships, but everything exactly the same. Everything to the point right there. Look on this feed. You see right here, they have a strike of the rain. And if we go back, we look, it's keep it exactly the same. It just only replace those elements. This is why I say it's a little bit more of the Queen uh, versus Flux because Queen, it's have a two, two models. By the way, I would recommend you check my other video where I compare and explain how they actually work. And the coin have it like two models, go to path, one generate and one compare, what is what's changing. Be sure to check that video. And right here, for example, I says add more people. See, it's leave it everything here, just add more people. 
and next we'll just add more and more elements by the way here's a little bit things i found uh, kind of bug maybe we can call it inside banana sometimes it's going cycle sometimes you ask and say do this and this and it just does not do it it just stay in the cycle and will generate same image over and over and over so yes i found this kind of problem inside here and that's what you'll notice sometimes right there it says create this create this it doesn't matter it's create same except when you have it kind of almost need break out of the circle for example the, here it says add a text and it's add text however i think it's got some limitation on what type of font it's having because even i specify like goth or other font it's for some reason just create one font does not even make like bold or any other things so maybe I need to practice a little bit more with this, but this is, seems like all what's happening. Yes, it can add shadows, drop shadows, but it is remind me very primitive changing. Okay, and then next, of course, we'll just take and we replace, well, it's not a banana. Yes, so I replaced the sword with banana. But at this point, I says, you know, go back to what we have before. And it is went back without me loading. So it's going to that version where it says, where it's holding this original sword so you can see this is benefit of hitting uh keeping all this history inside and creating well this is a fun uh element and maybe it's kind of some practical but let's look on real practical use and rich uh, practical use of this for example um i'm the geek i'm like sitting by the computer my wife she's more in a construction so yes she'll like to build interesting how world is changing yes so she'll like power tools she'll like to build it and right now she tear apart our backyard to create something more beautiful well sometimes it's very hard to ex express your vision you know to the people so right here she took the corner of our backyard photo and try to explain and i says well let's use it put to the test nano banana and uh, you can show me what in your mind so we actually open on a mobile phone which is uh, another plus compared to comfy ui you actually can run if you want to run on mobile phone you need to set up your proxy you need to do a lot of stuff to do this there is just gemini you open and you access and she says okay this is our backyard put it like trial trails right there with the plants make a fireplace round and remove this pallet right here put maybe a garden bed or something like this okay so we did it and right here you can see image look on this different so if we look on this this was before it's exactly the same the fence everything exactly the same it just add and created those trails and they look nice same things if you try like a queen or flax example flex look on this it did create it did remove it leave it some wall but it's like remove the car this is a very common problem you will see with flax it is will remove some details even you don't specify and the reason they don't have a feedback queen little bit better about this because they have it the two parallels one create and one will verification so it's kind of will leave the details there in this case it's work a little bit better but you still have the same problem because not enough language model to work properly around this and you can see the ground look this way yeah it, it did create nice but honestly it's a no compared to resolution and quality of the gemini in this case you can see how they look natural fireplace just look like right there and of course my wife she says you know um remove some of the barrels like for example right here see it's left buckets even if there was an original and we'll say remove buckets and look it just remove buckets it's sort of wall did it next says well let's put it like brick to see how it will go around place very natural in its instant things it was using bricks that was in a pile so it was a reference inside the image what it was creating and if you don't remember uh, just overall here is the pile of those bricks it was reusing and of course as she says i want square there you go and it's great square you can see how it's easy was created next she says well I remove all this crop on the back so you see it's removed uh, all additional created now i can see how to look and of course she says well what if we move this bed on the side and this is a big benefit it is allowed visualization look on this details everything still be there and right here the move bed and she asked let's put a small table chairs there see how it will look there you go and to make final touch i says let's put a monkey there who drinking the cocktail out of the pineapple so there you go we have a monkey backyard 
But let's look on another practical use and it's showing you true power of this. So right here, example, you're going shopping in a store, yes. And you walk there, you want to take your picture. You take your selfie in a mirror. And next you're like, how does this will be looking with the clothes that I want to purchase? So you take pictures of the shirts you want to wear. You're holding the shirt you want to wear before your trip to Hawaii. And then you're uploading, there's your shirt, and there you go. Now you have it yourself, taking exactly the same selfie as before, now in a Hawaiian shirt. Then next, we'll say, okay, let's put it our shorts. Same, we'll take those uploading shorts, say which one you wanted. And there you go, now your image, you can see how you will look with this Hawaiian shorts, uh, with the shorts and Hawaiian shorts. But nice well you can take even more it says okay it's nice i'm looking like this in a store how i will look in a hawaiian beach and you just need to only ask this and there you go now i even ask for the straw head honestly i did says put a straw head on me because i don't want and look it's add shadows on my eyes from straw head and there you go now it's how i will look in hawaii and of course if i'm on hawaii in my mind come up and says well you know what I want to look like uh, Master Yoshi from Dragon Ball. So it's actually, it's what I ask. It says, how I will look at Master Yoshi. And there you go. That is me looking as Master Yoshi from Dragon Ball. It's actually add some uh, things that I don't have it. Like, I don't know how many, it's six packs or whatever. And they're a little bit in a weird place. But, well, you get a point. Well, I hope you do. So right here, I want to show you another example. Look on this. So what I did. I took a picture of this vending machine with candy and you already notice I asked to replace this with meat. It did excellent. Well, point is not what is replacing. What I want to show you is a look on these reflections. Okay, this is before you see how the reflections a model AI was very smart to understand what is was packaging and what was relax, uh, reflections. And that is incredible because it will jump and compare between two of this. You'll notice reflections stay same. Reflections stay same. It just remove or change products and everything else is stay same. It is incredible. Of course, we lost some like this 25 cents, some numbers. I think they need to work a little bit better on those ones to recognize. But general reflection, everything, it is stunning how it's did. And because of this consistency, we can very easy create animations and movies now because all what we needed, it's a keyframes. Then we can use anything from video, voodoo, video, or other things, applications to put it start and frame and create beautiful animations. So example right here, this is a photo uploaded and I says, hey, you know what? I like this uh, alien from Mars attack. How about my next vision what i see in the eye i want to turn him sideways like camera panning around and a little bit zoom out so that's what i ask and it's creating exactly same character consistency it's unbelievable with nano banana seriously it is unbelievable consistency it did and look it's a turn around a little bit zoom out next i says hey how about you zoom more out and have the ray gun kind of pull up and they go look on this it is did what i ask so all what i need to do now is create this consistent characters and i can upload it if i have an x-ray gun i can upload it in reference as put this x-ray gun in a hand so this is what cannot be done with on your local computer because you just don't have this massive language model that allowed us to do here well that is not all i know some of you says well this is cool when you type and actually this is interesting because my wife point on this she says what if i want to use it in painting what if i want to just modify in one place what if i have a hard time to specify uh what to do well it's actually much easier when you think i have a video before when i show you what to do in the google ai studio for free i'll put a link also for you to check this video if you don't remember but point is this you're going on this service from google you just type applications you want it and it is really create 100 percent working applications for you i'm not kidding i created big games i created so many different services and here's i came and that says hey use it nano banana image editor like right here i says create for me 
in painting out painting with preview and other things what I want to do so all what I need to do here it's now upload image I want to do by the way here's a prompt and the prompt we need it just in case we want to do out painting yes this is can do out painting you can specify how much you want to zoom out you know how much you want to create and from which side so you can all this just adjustment but we'll go in and painting on the second so also a spec ratio we'll just leave it at this i don't want to change any art style this is all programmable it just says hey i want to do this and it will add but most important we have it look we have it in painting tool here i can just go and specify areas where i want to do this like right there actually let's create a little bit bigger like right here there you go i can go and says um add pink retro glasses okay just like this and click generate and there you go now you can see we generated glasses by in painting so it's okay if gemini there and with nano banana does not have it because you can easy create applications with this new stunning tool and by the way you can easy create here as of same as the frames this is the next application just simple type says hey this is my character i want to create with this script the keyframes and it can generate the keyframe for you with consistent characters to see how we can do this be sure to subscribe put it like and we'll do this in the next video creating special applications to generate our keyframe and create unbelievably animated video by utilizing vio and uh, nano banana well thank you for watching and we'll see you next time bye